to talk a little bit about the uh, deer fence that I put up. There was some interest there. Uh, <clears throat> did a whole deer fence for an 80 by 80. Um, here you can see it now, an eight, out in the distance, an 80 by 80 orchard area. I did it all for maybe $150. And essentially what I did was got a pole from the box store and the pole was eight feet long. It's about three quarters inch by an inch and a half. And what I did was, as you can see, I drilled holes about every foot and a half or so. Every foot, I drilled seven holes in eight feet. And so you can see the wire. Here's one that's installed. So from top to bottom. So I have these poles and I took PVC pipe and I cut the PVC pipe into sections about a little over a foot long. And then I hammered them into the ground like that and just took the pole, put it into the PVC like that. Pretty, pretty simple, pretty straightforward. And then what I did was I got the most inexpensive wire I could from Tractor Supply and ran seven, strain, seven uh, courses of wire over the, the eight feet, the top one being close to eight. So here's one that's in place. You can see it from top to bottom. You can see the seven wires. I do want to mention, oh, this one you can see I put some uh, some little fluorescent tape there because they're hard to see. Um, the other thing I want to mention is that the corner posts are two by twos. So I did a corner post with seven holes in it as well. So you can see this corner post. I have an angled wire going down to a stake so that holds that in. And I have some uh, fence set up so I can get in and out but you can see the whole the whole area is fenced with these and I know it's really hard to see the wire but a half a mile of wire at tractor supply costs about 40 to 45 dollars so that was 45 the PVC was maybe 20, and then the pieces of wood were maybe, I don't know, another 50. So this whole fence, deer fence, was made for less than a couple hundred dollars. And a lot of you know there's a lot of deer pressure around the United States. Um, so I did use a combination, I am using, um, if any of you use deodorant or um, Irish Spring soap, you can see that I have a chunk of Irish Spring on, on that fruit tree. So basically I'm using two approaches, the fence all the way around, and then every tree I'm planting in the orchard will have a little chunk of Irish Spring soap. 